Hello, and welcome to our video on the EPOS Now OpenTable integration. On the left hand side of my screen, we have the OpenTable interface, which is usually used on a tablet or laptop. On the right, we have the EPOS Now TILF screen. To place a walk in booking, click on the booking section, select the number of guests, and click Seat Now. Choose your table and hit Seat Now. This will fire the transaction across to EPOS Now which is signified with the new web order notification at the top of the screen. You can then collect this table by going onto the table plan, selecting your table and taking the order. You'll then place the order as you normally would through EPOS now. As you can see, we've also got Lewis Smith, who's placed a table booking in 10 minutes time for table three. Once they've arrived, again, select the table and click seat now. This will send across, as demonstrated a minute ago, and in the same manner, go to the table plan and collect the table. As you can see, Lewis Smith is a you know, customer assigned to this transaction as it tries to match the email address of the users in both systems. Again, you can place the order as you normally would within EPOS Now. This should send the transaction back to OpenTable in which you can view their transactional data. So when you click on the customer, Lewis Smith, you can see we have a POS icon seen here and the amount on that transaction. If you click on this, it will bring up a itemized receipt within OpenTable. You'll continue using the integration in your normal manner. So on your till, you will select your customer and finish the transaction as normal. Once you've cashed off the transaction, this again will send across to OpenTable which you can see is now changed to a paid status. You will then need to use OpenTable in your normal manner to change the status if they need to do any cleaning of the station or if they have then finished the booking. I hope this video has helped you get the most out of your EPOS Now OpenTable integration. Thank you.